sounding the alarm, but we have not been listening. The people in power have not been listening. I come here for a climate demonstration, not a political view. Civilization. We are not standing on the brink of a catastrophe, we are living in it. People on the front lines of the climate crisis have been experiencing the first-hand consequences of it for decades now, and they have been sounding the alarm, but we have not been listening. The people in power have not been listening. I come here for a climate demonstration, not a political view. that you're holding what does it mean actually uh, well so the our government the Dutch government um, is giving 37.5 billion uh, euros of subsidies to fossil fuel industry every year research showed uh, two months ago the, the research was published uh, I was really shocked by it because it, I thought it was way less um, so I couldn't believe my eyes and that's also drove me to, to here. This is my first climate march actually and I think um, uh, I think that's something really easy to change um, and I'm looking for uh, political parties who are after that basically. and about the biodiversity and I want to say to all the people uh, to uh, act green and I think it's possible now. We have so many uh, ideas and people who want it so uh, I really want to change and also because of the elections uh, that are coming now in the Netherlands that we can choose for uh, green options. The topic of climate change and sustainability is underlooked and I think it's super important. Uh, people don't have enough information, education and we do not talk about it enough and I think it's super important because we're all gonna die and it's not just jokes, it's a very serious matter and we have to do something as a collective. Yes. They are being exploited, sexually abused to fetch water even when they are pregnant. It is...